it's the job of an MP to give people a voice in Parliament. We should always be working with people, standing beside them, amplifying their voices. The Liberals in New South Wales have caved in to the shock jocks and are more interested in delivering for their big business mates than they are for our local community. And we're feeling more and more the effects of a warming planet and the destruction of our environment. What we do know is under a climate change scenario, which we're beginning to experience now, there will be more extreme weather events happening more frequently. I refuse to live my life on time borrowed from our children and grandchildren. Our society no longer provides for our most vulnerable people. The cost of living is high and there's real housing stress for people in our community. Housing should be a human right, but it's treated as a commodity. We need better rights for renters and to invest in quality public housing. It's tough getting around. The trains are crowded and bus after bus goes past already full. Labor and Liberal talk the talk, but when it comes to voting in Parliament, they both voted for the lockout laws. There's only the Greens that voted against the lockout laws. We have an economy geared towards the interests of the very few. Community is at the heart of all Greens' policies. We have never accepted corporate donations and will always prioritise the public good over private profits. The Greens have a plan to transform energy in New South Wales to make it 100% renewable by 2030. The Greens will support investment in affordable housing, public transport and healthcare. We will make TAFE free and we will fully fund our public schools. And we will always stand up for equality and human rights. Authorised by Andrew Blake for the Greens New South Wales, Sydney.